Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Friday Night Smackdown. What a show we had last week. Orange Cassidy, we had some controversy with him. And by the way, we are live from Biloxi, Mississippi for what will be a great show. Please do. Yes. And here comes the Smackdown General Manager. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the SmackDown General Manager, Colonel Sanders. Of course, Sanders showed up last week to uh, announce that Carnage would be in the main event against Johnny Gargano and that Orange Cassidy was not there in front of his home state crowd. But no, he somehow got backstage and took out Carnage uh, after the match. So we'll see what... Um... Hey, he tried separating these two before SummerSlam, but he failed miserably. Of course, this is the show before Sma or SummerSlam. Show before SummerSlam, so uh, he's probably got a lot to address. All right, I'm here to address SummerSlam and some controversy going on backstage. I want to start off with Orange Cassidy. Was not supposed to be here last show. But he got backstage. I don't know how. Security just sucks. Um, and attacked Carnage at the main after the main event last week. Well, knowing that this is the show before SummerSlam and we can't do much, I have no consequences for him. I can't just rob him of his title the show before he gets the opportunity. So, with that being said, there are no consequences for Orange Cassidy or Carnage, because Carnage did nothing. Um, there's not much to address other than that, other than the tag title match remains the same. The women's tag title match remains the same. And there's, there's not much of a difference. Anyway, well, you know. There's, there's just not much to come out here and say tonight. Just that we hope we avoid controversy tonight between Orange Cassidy and Carnage. And everything is okay. Oh. Oh, this could get interesting. Not good. <laughs> For oh, 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 ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the Intercontinental Champion and the man who will face uh, Carnage in the main event of SummerSlam for the Universal Championship, Orange Cassidy. As the ring announcer blanked on Carnage's name and could be murdered for that because Carnage is very, very aggressive. Yes. And uh, uh, <laughs> our like general manager is not very happy, yeah. Colonel Sanders, well this is the first time we're face to face and that is my contract signing. So, Carnage gets no suspension, I get no suspension, that's smart of you because you want your main event you know that me and Carnage are the only thing holding your show up. But I mean, on top of that, you kept me from my hometown crowd. The, what? What is wrong with you? I don't want you two getting into any controversy and possibly hurting yourselves before probably one of the biggest matches of the year, if we're being honest. So, you should be happy I'm trying to keep you in good condition for this fight, okay? I can't have one of my top-notch wrestlers getting hurt before one of the biggest shows of the year. Top-notch wrestler? No, 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 here's the thing. I am your top-notch wrestler. Not one of the top-notch wrestler. Nobody can beat me, such as Alexander, Carnage. It doesn't matter who. Johnny Gargano, Keith Lee. I can beat anybody. The thing is, I could compete in a Hell in a Cell Elimination Chamber and Royal Rumble on the same night and win all three matches. Look, I don't know what your reason to be out here talking to me right now is when really the only reason you're out here is to complain how you didn't get to perform in front of your home, your home state crowd. Is there any other reason you want to be out here right now or do you just want to waste my time? I want to face 
both Carnage and Johnny Gargano in a tag team match tonight. I don't care who my partner is. I don't even care if I get a partner. Make it a handicap. I could care less. I just want to fight Carnage and Johnny Gargano. Two of your best superstars. Besides me, of course. Okay, you know what? You're asking for it. I'll put you in the main event tag team title match tonight. But if something happens, if you get hurt, just know it's not my fault, okay? Your tag team partner tonight will be the number one contender for the NXT Championship, Johnny Gargano, okay? Not Johnny Gargano. Keith Lee. Whoops, I'm sorry. Okay. You understand? Well, besides your screw-up, yes, I think you're losing in your old age. Kind of like how you said uh, you think that me and Carnage are the only thing keeping your show alive when the only thing keeping your show alive is us. It's not a you think. We are the only thing keeping your show alive, otherwise AEW would be beating you. But anywho, yes, I understand. That's all I came out here for, really. So, I mean, you got anything to say, or am I going to get in trouble for name-dropping AEW? First of all, yes, I expect a hundred dollars from you by the end of tonight. And second of all, that's there's not much else to cover for you. Thank you for understanding. And it is not my fault if you get injured tonight and cannot compete at SummerSlam, okay? Well, the thing is, uh, if I get injured and compete, yeah, it won't be your fault, but I will still hunt you down go to your office, put you through your desk, and then I would demand for another title opportunity later down the road when I am here. Because the fact of the matter is, if I do somehow get injured, which I won't, you are going to give me my title opportunity back. And if I don't lose this match, I'm going to get another opportunity next night. And Orange Cassidy might have just roasted our general manager. Let's get on with the rest of the night, ladies and gentlemen. And ladies and gentlemen, it is main event time. The following contest is a tag team match. First, making his way to the ring, he is the Intercontinental Champion, the, the, the Orange Cassidy. The ring announcer, forget his name. I think he did. This ring announcer is not very good. We need to Boy, fight this guy. I must admit, Orange Cassidy looks really good with that Intercontinental title around his waist. Yeah, is this the first time we've seen it around his waist, I believe? Yeah, because he didn't, he didn't have it around his waist last week when he invaded. The May, okay, Keith, or Keith Lee, <laughs> Orange Cassidy made the jump over to WWE from the other company shocking the world, coming after Carnage, winning his match that they weren't even expecting to have, then gets into this rivalry, Adam Cole versus Orange Cassidy versus Elias versus Carnage, loses that Extreme Rules, horribly loses, mind you, and then ends up uh, winning a match against Cedric Alexander, becoming the Intercontinental Championship, the title that Carnage was forced to vacate, then loses, or no, yeah, wins against Cedric Alexander, goes on to face Carnage, they get separated, and now he comes crying to Colonel Sanders. I still can't take that statement seriously, I'm sorry. I'm, st I'm still trying to process that the general manager is, is Colonel Sanders. I, 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 I don't know if he has dem dementia or what, because he's a bit off, have you noticed that? He is, he forgets a lot what he's saying. It's, he seems like he comes out there to say very little and just kind of stays out there for the extra screen time. But, oh baby! And next, Mickey's run of the ring. Winging at 340 pounds from Wichita Falls, Texas, he is Keith Lee! Keith Lee! In his glory. It's the team of number Keith one contenders. Lee. One of the f most phenomenal superstars to step foot in the squared circle. Keith Lee, no doubt, absolute beast of a powerhouse. Former NXT champ, former North American champ. 
now is here on SmackDown competing. I mean, he's never won a for the NXT title. We'll go out at uh, NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. Of course, that is tomorrow night, Sunday. Keith Lee, Johnny Gargano, main event. Saturday. <laughs> you said Sunday. Oh, yeah, the next Friday night. This is Friday night SmackDown. Yeah, you said Sunday. Tomorrow, oh. Saturday. I said tomorrow, I thought. Okay, I'm losing it. Oh, baby! But now it's the other team! And their opponents. First. Here's the WWE Universal Champion. From Queens, New York, weighing in at 225 pounds, the Twisted Savior, Corner. I believe the ring announcer just got his weight wrong by about 35 pounds. 225? Is that what the is? No, I think the ring announcer got it wrong by about 35 pounds. I, think, I thought the ring announcer said 225. It's 190, I'm pretty sure. He's been saying 225 for weeks now. Has he really? Yes! That's the first time I've noticed. <laughs> Every time he announces Carnage, it's weighing in at 325 pounds. From Queens, New York, the Twisted Savior Carnage. Just every time! Carnage is looking good in that, that white attire, like white as silver. How are you only now noticing he says 225? I don't know. Oh, but it's the other champ! And next. Mika's one of the ring. He is the NXT Champion. Winging at 199 pounds from Cleveland, Ohio. Johnny Gorgano! Johnny Takeover getting ready to defend that title tomorrow against Keith Lee. And they don't call him Johnny Takeover for nothing. I I will be shocked if he loses at Takeover. I mean, Keith if he, Lee. What? If he loses what? I said I will be shocked if he loses at Takeover. Keith Lee's a I great. I don't know. Keith Lee's pretty phenomenal. He's phenomenal, yes, but Gano. He, he's been defensive. He's more of a defensive guy ever since this move up to SmackDown. Um, you know, and he displayed that in the last match, but it's Orange Cassidy versus Carnage oh. to start it off. Oh, no. And they're going to lock it up to start Carnage, we though. Get a taste Snap of suplex. This Sunday suplex. Carnage going to whip Orange Cassidy into the ropes. Roll oh. through. Twister roar. Is this could be the site this Sunday? Orange Cassidy Carnage. Uh oh, already a tagging. Tagging to Johnny. This won't be a fair oh. double super pick. Down goes Cassidy. That well, now be a Johnny Takeover. One on one. I don't think Cassidy was expecting a tag in this early. And look at Johnny wrestling. Oh, I'm straight to like gut. I ain't mean, Carnage, that might have been a smart move right there from Carnage, though. Try not to injure yourself, but have your opponent get injured? That's pretty smart. Oh, oh my god. Slinging himself over the top rope. Hitting a DDT on uh, Orange Cassidy. That Ooh. was going to whip him right into the ring post on the LED board. Of course, Johnny Gargano, he doesn't wrestle in three. Oh, oh, he boy. doesn't wrestle in That's two days. He doesn't wrestle in two days like the other two. He wrestles tomorrow. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Head bouncing off the LED board there. Johnny Gargano this time. Oh. Gargano whipping the face of uh, Orange Count Cassidy. Count of five. Office. Going up now top. Six. Count of six. Is the ref going to restart the count? Smart move by Johnny Gargano, but he's going to roll him in anyways. Oh, Gargano wants Keith oh, Lee! Tagging to Keith he Lee. wanted Keith this Lee! Could be the site tomorrow. Oh! Or, or preview to tomorrow, I mean. He wanted Keith Lee! And he's just going Johnny off Gargano. on Lee. 
just hammering away at Keep Lee. It's Whips good. him into the ropes, duck under. Oh, Hurricane oh, Rana. Rana! my god. The strength from Gargano. Of course, if Gargano loses tomorrow, though, he does get moved up full time to SmackDown. Yeah. Oh, so, I unless mean, is there an upside to it? Unless he revokes Reeve match clause, but if he loses True. there, then he's completely done. I still can't get over that hurt. Oh! Pounds. Dear God. Keith Lee is already trying to make a tag to Orange Cassidy. Right now, Gargano is on fire right now. He's fired up. Gargano. Look at Gargano now. Oh my oh. God. 340 pounds lifted like it's nothing. <laughs> He's going to go for the Gargano lock now. But Keith rope Lee has his rope. foot Keith on the gets rope. The foot on the rope. And oh, a tag and here we go. Twisted savior. This could be a dream Keith match Lee right is. here. Versus Carnage. Carnage is hammering away at Lee. We could see this sometime down the road in the future. Oh! Backbreaker and a Russian, Russian leg, leg sweep. Down sweep. Lee. Licking back the hair. Carnage gonna move in on Keith Lee. Pick him up. Uh oh. Keith Lee with oh, him took the down breath out. Breath. Carnage knee straight to the gut. And uh No Carnage missed! Misses! And Cassidy's Cassidy is gonna have time to Oh back. no. And remember this is what we're gonna see tomorrow. No, this is what we're gonna see Sunday. Or Sunday, my bad. Oh clothesline. Clothesline, Cassidy is decapitating Carnage. Now dragging him by the arm. Cassidy went for some there. Carnage able to get out of it though. Look at Cassidy now. Has the arm and oh. Carnage oh. fighting back. Oh! Punches straight to the gut. Uh oh! Uh oh. All tied up. Uh oh! Going for it. Dial it, it up. Boom! Connect. Carnage! Oh, Keith Lee in the way of Lee Carnage now! not gonna get in the way though. Uh oh. Picking Cassidy up. Oh, FNX cutter. cutter. Carnage going over the cover. Lee's gonna come in. One, one. kick out. Keith not not Lee a kick out. Lee one. Lee breaks it that up and uh oh. Smart. Oh god. Lee overhead belly to belly suplex. No, Carnage able to reverse it. Arm drag takedown. Down goes Lee. Oh look at this. The FNX cutter. Carnage. Is that is okay? That is one of. And he's now focusing on Keith on. Lee. Oh! oh okay. Lee has been beaten up in this thing. You're not gonna go over the fact that oh. he just hit the ton of his old tag team partner? Oh! That's uh -oh. your drop kick. Oh, you got frog splash. Carnage's gonna win. Right now, Cassidy, he's not in good shape, oh. but he, he's gonna get back on Carnage here. Uh oh! Cassidy. That's not smart keeping him in Gargano's corner. Uh oh. Of course, Orange Cassidy hasn't really oh. been that many tag matches though. As to where Johnny Gargano was a part of DIY, of course, him and Tommaso Ciampa. And then Carnage, was, down in Impact, was a tag team with uh, Destroyer. So, I mean, yeah. Chief and Orange Cassidy aren't as used to tag team more compared and to And he's Johnny. worked with more. He's had another tag partner in the independent scene. Frog Splash! Yeah. Cassidy in control right now. It's been a rough go not. so far. I thought he was going to just sit there. Go for the cover. Carnage whipped into, whipped the, corner. into the corner. Oh, I thought Cassidy was going to make the tag. Yeah. Then lift him up top. Oh god. No, 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 no. What is Cassidy doing? No, 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 no. 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 Cassidy? No. Oh! oh my god. The overhead power slam. Oh, Gargano's trying, trying to get into this thing. Look, here. while the ref is distracted, Carnage. All tied up. Kenneth. All tied up. Taking down on Cassidy. Carnage going Carnage top going rope top now. Rope, looking for a twisted roar, possibly. Carnage stepping off. Now he's just gonna go for the cover. 
Cover one. Not even not a one. Even a one cat. Oh, when look at Cassidy. Oh, Cassidy went for oh. The, uh, legs of carnage there. Oh, tagging to Johnny tagging Wrestling. Johnny Wrestling. Oh, missed with it there. Cassidy, now look. Cassidy's going to try to take advantage right now. Driver, sunset power driver, whatever it's right called. by Carnage. Oh, oh no. no. Rope break. Getting lucky there. Look at Keith Lee right now. He's... <laughs> looks broken on the side of the ring over there. But Cassidy's contemplating on what to do. He's going to make the tag. To the... The glory... To, uh... DDT by Keith Lee. Because it's Keith Lee tag. Oh, he's gonna tag... Back to Orange Cassidy. Cassidy back in here. Uh-oh! driver. Again! Cassidy's gonna go for the cover this time! One, One, two, two kick two. out at you from Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Gargano's endurance in this one. Cassidy wants him up. Cassidy's screaming, this is gonna be you, Carnage. Is that, I mean, he's not wrong. This could be car the site of Carnage is Sunday. Close on. Oh, Johnny Cassidy misses missed. the clothesline that time. Uh-oh, look at this now. Oh! Oh, oh punched the oh, carnage out of down. nowhere! And look at Cassidy now! It's over! Good driver. night in the corner. What's he doing? Oh. Well, Carcano just falls over. Oh. oh. Cover. One, two, three. Shock and win. Orange Cassidy and Keith Lee picking up the win over Johnny Gargano, the NXT champ, and Carnage, the Universal champ. Good strategy. Cassidy acted like he was going to do nothing to Carnage there. All of a sudden turns around, knocking him off the apron. And that's where Shortly the turning point was. Cassidy has kind of been playing mind games too, which is not normally something he does, but I mean, when you're facing Carnage, it's something you have to do. I think there was a heartbeat last week. And, to get and Cassidy head. could be sending a message. Who are your winners? The number one contender for the NXT Championship, Keith Lee, and the Intercontinental Champion, and the number one contender for the Universal Championship, Orange Cassidy! And we thank you for tuning in to Friday Night SmackDown, and we will see you at SummerSlam. Good night.